Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I've got a lot of goodies to show you. I am doing a big haul from Ross. Um, I got a couple things from Walmart I'm going to show you that I got, but everything else is from Ross. Ross always has some fantastic deals. And unfortunately, because of COVID, they're lacking a little bit in items that they have. So we found some great things for some birthdays coming up, for some Christmas ideas, and just some other random stuff. I'm going to get into it with you. Don't know when the last time I did a video was. It's been a good hot minute, but new fresh hair, fresh face. There is no makeup on it, so bear with me on that one. But I'm going to jump into what I got. I have a lot of cute little outfits to show you. But first I'm going to start with toys. Yes, Ross is kind of hit or miss on the toys. But we found some good deals. And my toddler will be turning three in November. So this is great for Christmas and her birthday. So whatever she's going to get for her birthday, then she'll get for Christmas. The first thing I'm going to show you is a big item. It's going to be our big hot dollar item. Um, it normally retails at Walmart for about $33 and change. I did get another um, set from Walmart. It's actually put away right now, so I'm not going to go dig that out for you. But it goes with this set. Leap Builders, or Leap Frog, has come out with Leap Builders. And it's a cute little, kind of like a Lego type set, but you have this and you do a lot of learning. I'm not going to turn it on and show you guys because our walls are thin and there are little children out in the other room. So I'm not going to do that because they will hear. But this one does the alphabet. It obviously says two plus, but I'm sure my other little girl who's about 10 months old will play with this. But this was only... Yikes. There you go. I'm not even going to edit that out. Just not even want to. There are little buttons on there. <laughs> Whoops. Anyway, it does, it was for $19.99. It says here the comparable value is $27, but I don't know where they're getting that $27 from because at Walmart is $33.22, at least on their website. Um, 170 phrases, learning phrases, sounds, colors, shapes, animals, numbers, letters, objects. It has to have its two cents in there. But yeah, I think it's really, really cool. And of course she's big into like the Legos with her older brothers. She, you know, we have the huge, like, Mega Block or Duplos or whatever, but she doesn't really play with those. I think those are for her on the younger side. She likes to sit into the box and not really play with them. So this is great. Like I said, there is another set that we did get her. Another thing that we found for her is this super adorable tea set. It's got 15 pieces what it looks like on the back and we only got it for ten dollars now again it says comparable but comparable value is eighteen dollars but again I'm sure it's probably more I would have to google this to see exactly how much it retails for but it is a tin tea set got little unicorns all over it got the plates little cups the teapot I think she would adore this. Like every little girl should probably have a tea set. I don't have to, but it would be really cute. And she's into that huge like imagination make believe. Now when she plays on her tablet, there's this game and I don't know what it's called, but she makes these little smoothies. And in the game, she puts in all the fruit and blends up the smoothie in the blender. And she loves smoothies at home. So we found this cute electronic blender. You got the little fruits, you got your glasses, you got your little ice cubes, you got your lemons. And this has workable buttons and it actually does spin. Again, I'm not gonna push the buttons. You can probably hear her in the background. There is 13 pieces. 
there is a reset and add seconds. So the maximum is 20 seconds. Press start and stop. And then you'll hear a cute little beep whenever it's done. And of course, if it's not in use, it will go into a sleep mode after one minute of no use. Now something else I found is for our almost 10 month old. This will suction onto a high chair, a table, or it's just fun to play with. We got it for $5.99. I don't think I said what that blender was. Let's see, the blender was $12.99. It says comparable value $20, but it was $12.99. This is $5.99, typically about $10. It's an Infantino brand. It does suction and you just, push these little, or like pull them out. And of course you can push them back in. And that little top spins. So it's super cute for the babies. It does say three months and up, but we really got it because it suctions the high chair and that's something great that she can play with while we're doing dishes, whether we're eating and she's just not eating, whatever the case may be. Now this really isn't a toy, but we were at Hobby Lobby and Michael's one day and I got a couple um, painted rocks sets. Now Five Below had one that was Toy Story. We got that one. The paint didn't really stay on there. Like it was super watery. It wasn't a watercolor paint, but it was super watery. It dried really dull on the rocks. Like the paint wasn't even made to go on the rocks. Um, so I grabbed one from Michael's and then we saw this at Ross yesterday for $3.99. It is, let's see, two pounds of rocks. You get one bag of rocks, six paints, one paintbrush, one marker, and eight gems. So you just kind of create your own little rocks. And of course around here, I don't know where you're at, but of course around here, there are people who go around and just hide rocks. And you know, if you find one, you take a picture of it, post it with a hashtag on Instagram or post it on the Facebook group, and then you go hide it somewhere else. So it's really fun for the kids. And I really wanna get my kids involved. It's another way to get out, get some fresh air and still be interactive with people without an actually interacting with people because of COVID. So this is great. Two pounds of rocks for $3.99. And this also is not a toy, but with school possibly starting in the fall, my mother-in-law usually watches our toddler for two, three days out of the week. And I usually have to pack a diaper bag or pack a small bag for her. So she's been really interested in backpacks. So we found this cute little backpack at Ross for $5.99. It is like a teal color, turquoise color. Look at this cute sparkly unicorn. It's got the little unicorn horn. Now, I'm not really a big fan of glitter, but super cute. This is a pocket. And of course you have the big pocket big deep backpack so we can always put some diapers or pull-ups or underwear whatever the case may be a little change of clothes maybe some snacks or some toys she's got plenty of that over there already but you know just to make her feel special to have her own little backpack we got her one and i think she will love this and again that was only 5.99 tell me where you can find a backpack like this for less and then another item that's not a toy is this mason jar. Now I'm sure you're like, yeah, you can get that at Walmart. You can get that at TJ Maxx, wherever. It was $2.99, $2.99 right there. It is a 20 ounce jar. It does have the clip for it. And really I got one of these. I actually have two, but I got one of these for my leftover press-ons. I do a lot of press-ons. I have Red Aspen, I have Kiss, I have LA Nails, I have um, Pretty Woman. There's a couple other ones I probably have, Dashing Divas. 
I think that's all of them I got. But I have different brands of those. And instead of continually keeping the boxes and having them stacked up, I can just put them in here. And then I can always just pull some out and like do mix and matches. And it's a great way to keep your press on nails somewhere other than the box and it saves space. The other jar I got, it's very similar to this, or maybe it's bigger, I don't remember. But um, it is for our seven-year-old. Now, some of you may have followed me on Instagram, Facebook. I may have said so here on YouTube, but he was diagnosed with depression, anxiety, social, di uh, social anxiety disorder, sensory processing disorder, inattentive ADHD. Sometimes he can get aggressive. Sometimes he can just have bad moods. Um, and he has this, this habit of yanking toys out of his sister's hands or telling people what they can and cannot do, especially his siblings. You know, go do this, go do that. You can't do this, you can't do that. So our therapist has come up with a reward system. So pretty much, you know, if you could hand your sister her toy without throwing it, then we'll put a marble in the jar or we'll put three marbles in the jar. If you can go brush your teeth without an argument, you get marbles in the jar. If you misbehave or don't follow the rules, we will take marbles out of the jar. So there's, there's a reward at the end, whether it's an ice cream, whether it's a zoo trip, something, you know, there is a reward at the end of the jar. Um, and again, you can probably hear the two year old throwing her fit. They're all tired. They stayed the night with my in-laws. One of them was up at four o'clock in the morning. The other one, I don't know. It's about her nap time. So that's the reason why I got two of these. And $2.99 can't beat that. All right, so now on to the clothes. I'm actually gonna start with Walmart because there's actually a couple things that aren't clothing items. Like I said, I am wearing press-ons. These are Kiss. And actually I got another set of them. And I love how they have these little tabs because then I can put glue on my nail and on the actual press on and hold the tab and put my nail on without getting glue on my fingers. And so far I haven't had any scratches or chipping or anything of that sort. I've had them on for about a week. There's 28 nails. I think these were like $3 and change or something, $5 and change. But I got another pair of them. Then I went with a different brand, LA Colors. I did a white with silver, it's called Galaxy Dust. And I'm really interested to try these because a couple brands that I have that had just stark white nails or they were an ombre nail, they started to chip or they started to fade and I didn't really like that. So I'm interested to see how these hold up. The other one I got is, it's called Nude to White and it is a coffin, um, coffin shape which I'm getting used to wearing. I actually like the shape and I like the squared tip. These are more like a nude to white, so they are more of an ombre color. This actually has 33 pieces in there. All right, so now onto the clothing and I will take photos of them, post them in the video for you if I can't show the entire thing. All right, so the first things I'm gonna show you, my seven-year-old is proportionately average to a nine-year-old. He needed new underoos. So we ended up getting him two sets of four boxers. So he now has eight boxers. And we got him some in Justice League. Super cute, Batman. Superman. And then all of them there. And then we got him some Star Wars. They're like a really satiny, silky feel to them. That's really cool. And they were, the Star Wars was $6.99 at Ross and the Justice League was $7.99. So eight pairs of boxers for really the price of one set because it does say comparable value about $15. So get those for him. Then of course, I always have to look for my kids while I'm shopping. So my husband found this cute little 2T size shirt for $4.99 for our two year old. And I love how it looks like a little dress. Like on the back, it's got that little crease there. 
super cute it's like a peachy pink color and we'll get these for her birthday which is coming up in november this i may actually give to her before because i'm not sure how the weather is going to do it's 9.99 comparable at 16 to 20 dollars it's a super cute coral colored romper look at that unicorn and then it comes down to these pants i mean it's super cute got this little bow and these are super airy super super lightweight i mean you can pretty much see through them that is how lightweight they are and of course they scrunch down there at the bottom and this is also a 2t and then i found these really cute cut off shorts for 5.99 also in a 2t has a little rainbow right here on the pocket the rainbow strips it even has a little rainbow belt buckle and of course they're cute little cutoffs again $5.99 and it does actually say here because it's, it's funny because you can see comparable value $12 right well here on the actual tag it says the MSRP is 30 so what's the comparable value at I'm a little confused anyway then we saw this other cute set, which is a 2T we got for $7.99. She loves Minnie Mouse. Super cute shirt. Got this little frilly tool on the bottom and then kind of like a board short style because they're not like the little bitty shorts. They're not the long shorts, but they are like a board short style. Minnie Mouse, super, super cute. And yeah, that was $7.99, $7.99 for that one. And then this is a 24 month four piece for $9.99. It does have an MSRP of $32, $32. But yet we got it for $9.99. And it says magically still awake, super cute got the long sleeve and the pants and on this side you have the short sleeve as well as the pants so two sets four pieces for $9.99 which retail for $32 all right so a Walmart I'm gonna see if I can't post a photo and put it like over here somewhere for you guys because I'm not gonna be able to get this all in photo for you this is a size large I do wear a size 10 ish in women's and I can wear like a 9 11 in juniors so I ended up getting a large which is an 11 13 and this is from no boundaries so it's the Walmart and it was priced at $16.96 <clears throat> this cute little halter dress it does have a little see-through right there and it is a dress but it has the shorts right there on the inside so that has this like flowy material behind it kind of like a high low dress but you got the shorts instead now of course when i was looking at this i'm like that doesn't seem like it's like a teenager ish does it because i'm 36 people but i figured it's really cute it's flowy it's a great cute little summer outfit and you know i can really wear it whenever to be honest and just put like a, a shirt over the top whenever it's cold weather but again I will post a photo like right here for you guys of this dress to show you what it looks like the other thing I got at Walmart and again I will post right there because that seems like the best place to put it is a romper now I went to a store called painted tree painted tree marketplace or painted tree something or another and it's like one big large farmers market they've got all sorts of stuff clothes jewelry food items souvenir type items handcrafted items you name it it's really cool and i found this cute romper and i had to get a small in it which i'm not sure if it's good or bad <laughs> because the small actually fit perfectly so it may just be the size of the like how they make their rompers but i ended up getting a large at walmart again this is 16.96 again no boundaries i love the color i love the design i love that it has these bust area for you 
And of course I'm, I can't say I'm well endowed, but I do breastfeed. So this will be great to take off like the strap and just kind of pull down when I'm nursing. I love the design. I love that texture there. It's kind of a stretchy material. It's very lightweight. And again, it is a romper pants. The only downside I'm seeing to this and maybe it's something I have to get over is whenever I hold it up or even when I wear it, it seems like I'm wearing high waters. And if you don't know what high waters are, they're when you wear a pair of pants and they come up a couple inches above your ankle. So then it looks like you're about to go wading in water. So I'm not sure if it's supposed to be made like that because every size I tried on was the same way. So it's supposed to be like that, I guess. Or maybe I'm just too tall. I don't know. But I will post the image right there for you of the full item. It's super cute. And it's soupy. Soupy. It's soupy. It's super airy and flowy. And it'll keep me nice and cool during the summer months. <laughs> now this item I got from Ross. It is... How much did I spend on it? $8.99. $8.99. And... I went to bed and I was like, why did I get that? Because I, I don't know how I'm going to be able to nurse in that. Maybe I can try to pull down the, the collar of it. I haven't tried it yet. And of course, with COVID, dressing rooms are closed. So I really have to try on all these outfits. And I will do a try on if you want me to. And then post my picture as well of me wearing the item. But it is a cute navy blue t-shirt dress and if I can find these because I found them at Ross I will look for the brand and I will see if I can find a photo like a stock photo and post it there as well otherwise I will take photos for you but it is a t-shirt dress super cute super flowy it does come with a gold accessory necklace already which just attaches on the inside there you can always take it out and wear your own accessory that's what I do but yeah I think that's super cute now, you may need to possibly wear something underneath. I don't know. Again, I haven't really tried it on. So I will try that on and take a photo for you. But again, I was kind of sitting there going, can I maybe pull it down to nurse? I don't know. When you're a breastfeeding mom, that's all you think about is, can I easily access the breast to feed the baby? It's usually what I think about when I buy clothes. When I'm not nursing, it's a whole other thing. All right, and that was actually a medium. This one is also a medium, $7.99. It is a mustard yellow t-shirt. I love the shoulder cutout. Love, love, love that. Again, it's a very simple shirt. Very simple. It does need to be ironed, but it has that cutout, which makes it really unique. The next shirt I got in a large, and I, I tend to wear medium or large depending on the brand, but this one I got in a large because I wanted to make sure it was long enough. $6.99, I've had four children, so I still have a little mommy pouch. It is this mauve color. Now you may think it's very simple, but if you lift it up a little bit, you see that it's already pre-twisted, pre-knotted. I don't think there is a way to undo that. I think it is stitched that way. And I think it's super cute. So I ended up getting a large just so I can make sure that it does cover the mom tum a little bit. And again, I will see about finding photos or trying them on and posting the photo for you. This next one is another very simple solid color. It is $4.99. It is this really pretty faded denim blue color. It looks a little darker on camera, but it is a faded color. And there's nothing further down. The reason I got this is because I love this neck design right here, this collar design. Very simple, yet this gives it character and I love it. It also is a large, but I it scoops down here as you can see. It kind of scoops upwards, so I wanted to make sure that the sides were long enough and not showing the muffin top. This next one was kind of out of my comfort zone, but I thought it was super cute and I had to get it. I had to have it. $6.99, it is a large. It is more of a blouse. Now you're thinking, whoa. 
I think it's really cute. I really do. And it does have a little pocket right there. It does have this little neck closure, I guess, if you really need to. It, I mean, it does stretch, so you can take that closure there, but I should be able to fit my head in that without undoing it. It is very see-through, so you will need to wear a shirt under it. Very flowy, very cute. Again, I will take a photo for you guys. Next one is a size medium, $8.99. Cute little halter tank. Love the collar detail. Had to make sure it would fit around the girls there. <laughs> and I love the backing. But I love the texture, like you can actually feel the texture in there. Like the little designs, you can feel the texture. It's almost like it's been embroidered, but I love it. And the last thing I got from Ross is another romper. I'm in my mid thirties and I'm just now wearing rompers or getting, getting rompers, but here we go. Tank top, it is a size medium for $10.99 got a white tank they are adjustable straps and then it does have this belt right here and it is a navy blue stripe and again I will try to take a photo or find the stock photo for you guys but I think it's really really cute obviously it's something to wear a bra under because it is see-through but that's completely up to you but that is my Ross haul. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I enjoyed showing you everything. Great deals, all under $200. Some great summer outfits, some great birthday gifts, and some great household things. Check out your Ross. Let me know what you got. I will try, like I said, to get everything over in this area for you. So if they're there, they're there. If not, they're not. <laughs> I will try to link everything if I can. Um, I definitely can link the nails for you. And if there's anything else you guys want to see in the future, let me know. I got some ideas rolling through my head. And until the next video, I hope you guys have a wonderful day, wonderful weekend, whatever time you are watching this. I hope you have a great day. Smile, share your love with everybody, stay safe, and stay smart about everything with COVID. Good night.